For this video, I'll be discussing about data masking, which is one of the ways that we can have data privacy, and particularly here uh, using SQL. So the objectives of this video is for us to be able to utilize data masking in my SQL. Remember, uh, be sure that the data masking plugin is installed in your database in your MySQL uh, server so that you can make use of these functions. So what I'll be doing here is just to show you examples of uh, these functions while I explain the function themselves. So here we have the mask pan and you notice that it will uh, mask some of the values and leave the last four uh, it will only reveal the last four values so replace all with X we also have the mass pan relaxed so what uh, will this do is uh, one two three four six six uh, characters the beginning and the last four characters but it will not show or it will mask the other characters so let's say for example you want to display uh, the credit card number the uh, account number or maybe the email without displaying the whole item so we can use mass pan or mass pan relax or even the mass ssn for uh, this specially made for social security number but American version so it will only display the last four digits so this is an example of using the data masking functions in my SQL now here are other functions with this a more flexible one to have the mask inner so let's say for example mass inner this is a string we want to mass and then uh, this number uh, pertains to the number of characters that will be revealed in this string this is at the beginning and at the end so here if you say one then the first character will be revealed and there will be no more characters that will be revealed in our function so it will only reveal m and then followed by x x x x x now we have another syntax for this so mass inner the same function so we have here uh, the string that we want to mass zero means we're not going to mass anything at the beginning or we're not going to reveal uh, I mean to say anything at the beginning and four that means we'll reveal the last four value and we're going to use asterisk for masking so in the first one if you don't specify it will use letter X but here we specify asterisk so it will use asterisk and then it will only reveal the last four values so similarly we have this one mask inner so we have here our email for example so that means we're not going to reveal anything at the beginning and we're going to show 12 at the end and we're going to use hyphen for masking so that will be the result so let's have a recap this one will reveal only the first character Again, since we did not specify what will be used for masking, it will use letter X. Here, it will not reveal anything at the beginning. It will only reveal four characters at the end and using asterisk for masking. So if we have this value, again, it will only show the last four. So here, similar to this, it will only show the last 12. And it will use iPad. And here is the reverse of mass inner, the mass outer. So here it will 
if you place here 5 instead of revealing 5 the first 5 characters it will hide or it will mask the 5 characters and then it will not mask the remaining so it's the reverse of mask inner and then it will use what it will use uh, question mark in masking so it's just the reverse of mask inner and that ends the demonstration on how to use masking in my sql so again you have to be sure that the data masking that dll or the plugin is installed in your mysql server for you to be able to use these uh, functions thank you very much